The modern Aloha shirt was first created back in the 1930s. From their original vintage designs, Aloha shirts have evolved over the decades to reflect trends in style and fabrics. But one thing that hasn't changed that much is the actual manufacturing process of these Hawaii-made shirts. The first step for the manufacturer is to choose which prints to make into shirts. Then each roll of fabric is loaded onto a rolling track and laid out one layer at a time. Sometimes this process can include several hundred layers and take over a day to finish. Then a sheet of fabric with the outlines of the different shirt parts is laid onto the stack of fabric and stapled down to secure it for cutting. Next, a technician uses an electric blade to cut through the fabric, carefully following the outlines on the sheet. One mistake here would be very expensive since it would ruin the entire production run. Here the technician is cutting 340 layers of fabric, which in a few days will become 340 shirts. Once the shirt parts are cut out, they are bundled up and sent to contractors for sewing. After the shirts are sewn together, the buttons are put on using a special button machine. And then each shirt is ironed by hand. Finally, the finished shirts are stored in a warehouse according to size, print, and color, ready to be flown to stores and customers all over the world.